In this very special easy weeknight meal, I've partnered with Lighthouse Foods to make this delicious shortcut recipe for silken or reshmi chicken kebabs. Hi everyone, I'm Karen Ahmed. I love to make elaborate recipes on the weekends, but come midweek, I'm out of prepared meals and so tempted to order takeout. Stop. Using a few shortcut strategies and a mad dash to the store for fresh and even store-bought products, you will get a tasty plate of home-cooked food on the table for your family in under an hour. This needs to be fast and fresh. Welcome to Cravings Food Adventures, easy weeknight meals. Silken or Reshmi chicken kebabs are known for their delicious, creamy taste and very tender texture. These are smoked in a tandoor and are typically served with a lovely naan or as a gluten-free option, you can also serve it with some lettuce. Now, the folks at Lighthouse Foods gave me two of their dressings to try. I tried the Caesar dressing and the ranch and both of them worked really well, but the Caesar dressing had a little bit of an advantage. It contains cream, parmesan and herbs. Now, these are all ingredients that are used in a traditional silken or reshmi kebab. Typically, chunks of chicken meat are soaked in cream, cheese and cashew paste and are smoked in a tandoor. I'm going to use this very delicious dressing to make a really quick shortcut method. I'm going to bump up the flavor with some more garlic and some more herbs. I'm going to skewer it and put it on my hot smoking grill. Then I'm going to serve it with a lovely homemade naan, but as a gluten-free option, you can also serve this with some Boston lettuce. Now I know you're dying to know how to make this recipe. Before we go any further, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. I upload new videos every week, so make sure that you're subscribed so you're the first to see my videos. Also, ring the bell, that's YouTube's new bell icon that will ensure that you're notified every time I upload a new video. Now let's get cooking. Here is the inspiration for this recipe, Lighthouse Caesar Dressing. I've also got two chicken breasts, lime, coriander and mint, green chili, garlic and peppercorns. I'm going to crush some black pepper in my mortar and pestle, followed by equal quantities of chopped garlic, green chilies, coriander and mint. I'm going to pound everything together. I'm going to very quickly prepare these chicken breasts. I'm simply going to tug at the chicken tender to remove it. And then I'm going to cube the rest of the chicken breast. I'm going to repeat this process with the other chicken breast and keep it aside. I've got half a lime and I'm just going to squeeze the juice all over the chicken to tenderize it. And I'm just going to get into this bottle of Caesar dressing and add six tablespoons of this creamy deliciousness. I'm also going to add a teaspoon of fresh black pepper and a tablespoon of the crushed garlic, mint, coriander and chili. Add a pinch of salt. Mix everything together really well. Because this is an easy weeknight meal recipe, we're going to cook this right away. But you can just as easily make this ahead and leave it to marinate in the fridge overnight. Using some metal skewers, I'm just going to skewer the chicken. Metal skewers don't need soaking and it's a better conductor of heat than bamboo skewers. The barbecue is preheated and sprayed with oil and I'm going to add my skewers onto the hot grill. Allow them to cook and caramelize. and then I'm going to turn it over and cook it on the other side. Brush with the leftover marinade and continue to cook. Once ready, remove from the barbecue and allow to cool. I'm ready to serve now. I'm gonna use one of my homemade naans. I'm also gonna drizzle some more of that delicious dressing. I'm gonna add some of my chicken, some mint and coriander leaves, and I'm gonna finish off with some shallot rings. Now let me just take a quick break to take a little bite. Mm. 
And here's a gluten-free option. A Boston lettuce leaf makes a great wrap. These are ready to sink your teeth into. Thank you so much for joining me on Cravings Food Adventures. I really hope you enjoyed this very delicious recipe for silken or reshmi kebabs. Thank you Lighthouse Foods for sharing your product with me and enabling me to make this delicious recipe. If you're looking for this dressing, you can find it in the cold section of your grocery store. Cold is where it's sold and for good reason, it's full of fresh products. It's so delicious, I can literally eat this dressing straight out of the bottle with a spoon, don't judge. Make sure that you're subscribed to my channel. I upload new videos every week. Make sure that you're subscribed so you're the first to see it. Also, please do share my channel and my videos with your family and friends. I really hope to hit the 20,000 subscriber mark by the end of the year, so please help me get there. Also, ring the bell. That's YouTube's new bell icon that will ensure that you're notified every time I upload a new video. And don't stop there. Follow me on all of my social channels. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and even Snapchat. Until I see you next time, have a great week, guys. Bye.